Hey Wastelanders, I have a question for you. Have you ever seen a night or a vid a movie called Chaos Walking? It's kind of a sci-fi movie, and uh, I know it has a uh, bad ratings on there, five point seven. But I think it was a decent movie. It was like maybe a seven, six and a half to seven. I, th I thought it was a decent movie, but uh, it's not the movie what I'm talking about. It's the knife that he had in the movie. He had a folding knife that was possibly a buck knife, the folding hunter, I, I believe. I, I'm, I'm, I can't find anything. I can't find any images. I'll try to find some video when I post this video, but I'm pretty sure his knife of choice was a folding knife or folding buck. I don't remember what it was. It was a 110, 112, something like that. And he threw it all the time. But I wonder if you guys ever saw the movie. I think I saw it on Hulu, I think. I think I saw it on Hulu. Uh, it's worth checking it out, um, especially for a good old-fashioned American knife making it into the videos and a, a traditional knife or, or a lockback. So this this uh, is based on a book. I don't. It's directed by Doug Lyman, and Doug Lyman is a a favorite director of mine. I watch all his movies, whether he's good or bad. I like his movies. Um, I think it's this uh, story is based on. Oh, it's based on a book called "The Knife of Not Never Letting Go." I don't, I don't know what it's. I don't know what the book is about, but I don't want to spoil the movie for you. It's a, uh, it's just an odd, odd, really weird movie, sci-fi flick. So, if you. If you like it or you dislike it, let me know. Um, I'm recommending it to check it out. I, like I said, it's 6.5 or 7. I thought it had uh, really good special effects and an interesting story. And for some reason, I uh, wanted to buy a buck lockback after the watching it. <laughs> All right, take care, Wastelanders.